WFNN. Headline News Update. Okay, folks, uh, I posted a chart for a happy new year for everybody with my little Christmas hat on. And I wish everybody a wonderful uh, Christmas holiday. Folks, there's people out there that are really hurting. Yesterday, Sarah and I were running around town doing some errands, and we stopped in a restaurant. And the lady that waited on us, I'm not kidding you, she was between 85 and 95. I don't know. I was embarrassed to ask her how old she was. She was still pretty good mentally. She had a really good sense of humor, and she was working really hard. And I asked one of the workers over there, when I went over there, I said, boy, I said, she works really hard and it was the assistant manager and she said I wish I had 10 more like her (laughs) but anyway it was really strange to see her doing that maybe she does it just for fun I don't know but it really shook me up because I was thinking how hard my grandmothers worked they worked up until the very end and they lived very a long time so uh, and that's what I do too so I guess it's no different who knows anyway we got the markets up really strong today uh, short covering rally no question about it you can see very very light volume it's almost like everybody's on vacation out there uh, we had gold make a new high in the week and now it's reversed we were looking to get a place to be short that at uh, made a nice little 382 pattern if you want to have a chance to look at it. And then also, uh, we have all the stocks are up. We were up about 600 points in the Dow. We're not up, uh, came back about 150 points off of that. But the NASDAQ is just plugging along, just barely barely rallying at all. I mean, it's just this, this is a definition of a dead cat bounce. But again, you know, we've got uh, two more days to go. And remember, Friday is going to be even weaker than Wednesday and Thursday. So, Remind ourselves, we are in the Christmas atmosphere. Now, starting Monday, uh, they're getting ready for the new year, and and, and it'll start to pick up because people are doing cross-trades and stuff in stocks for tax purposes and things like that. But basically, it's going to be very thin. So be careful and uh, trade what you see, not what you think. So live every day in an attitude of gratitude, and may God bless, and stay tuned for Trade What You See by yours truly, Larry Pesavento. We'll be right back. (laughs) 